Hi friends, in this video we are solving problem on maxima and minima for the single valued function. Okay, here the given function is f of x is equal to 2x cube minus 3x square minus 36x plus 2. Okay friends, now how to find the maxima and minima we have to discuss first and then we will go for the solution. Now working rule to find the maxima and minima we are discussing. Consider the given function f of x. We have to differentiate the given function with respect to x. Then we will have f dash of x. This is the step 1. After that in the step 2 we need to find out the stationary points. Okay. We need to find out the stationary points. At the stationary points we can find out the extreme values that is either maximum or minimum value. Okay. Now to get the stationary value, equate the first derivative to 0. Then you will get the values of x as x is equal to a1, a2 and so on. Okay. The, these values are depends upon the given function. In the step 3, we have to find out the f double dash of x. After that, uh, at each stationary point, we have to find out the sign. So, at x is equal to a1, we have to find out the f double dash of a1. That gives a uh, either greater than 0 or less than 0 or is equal to 0. If it is greater than 0, then you can say f of x has minimum at uh, x is equal to a1. If f double dash of a1 is less than 0, then you can say f of x has a maximum at x is equal to a1. If you are getting f double dash of a1 is equal to 0, then we have to go for further investigation. Similarly, we need to find out at x is equal to a2, a3 and so on. So this is the working rule to find the maximum and minimum for the single valued function. Now coming to the solution. Let the given function f of x is equal to 2x cube minus 3x square minus 36x plus 2. Okay. This is the given function. We are considering as equation number 1. Now to get the maximum and the minimum values, we have to find out the stationary point. For that, we have to differentiate f with respect to x. Then it gives a f dash of x. Now, this value is equal to x cube derivative is 3x squared. So, 3 times of 2 is 6x squared minus x squared derivative is 2x. 2 times of 3 is 6x minus 36 into x. x derivative is 1. So, you will have minus 36. Now we need to find out the stationary value. For that uh, we have to equate f dash of x is equal to 0 which implies 6x square minus 6x minus 36 is equal to 0. On taking 6 common then we will have x square minus x minus 6 is equal to 0. So this one you can also write 6 factors are 3 and 2. Okay. Now you can write here x square minus 3x minus 2x x square minus 3x plus 2x minus 6 is equal to 0. So on simplifying you can take x is a common then you will have x minus 3. Here you can take plus 2 common then you will have x minus 3 is equal to 0. If x minus 3 is a common you can write x minus 3 times of x plus 2 is equal to 0. Therefore you are getting x is equal to 3 comma minus 2 are stationary points. So at the stationary points we can discuss the extreme values. For that in the step 3, now we have to find out f double dash of x. So differentiate uh, this equation 2 with respect to x, then we will have f double dash of x. If I differentiated this one, then x square derivative is 2x. So 2 times of 6 is 12x minus 6x derivative is 6 and the constant derivative is 0. So no need to write. Now we have to discuss at each stationary value f double dash of x value. So in the first step at x is equal to 3 we have f double dash of 3. What is f double dash of 3? 12 times of 3 minus 6. We know that 12 times of 3 is nothing but 36. 36 minus 6 is 30 which is greater than 0. So from the definition you can say at x is equal to 3 f of x has minimum at x is equal to 3. Okay. Now coming to the second one, at uh, x is equal to minus 2, we have to discuss f double dash of x value. So f double dash of minus 2 is equal to here. 
12 times of minus 2 minus 6. So, which is less than 0. This is minus 24 minus 6 is nothing but minus 30, which is less than 0. So, we can say f of x has maximum where it is at x is equal to minus 2. So, if you want maximum value at x is equal to 3, you will have this is a maximum. This is at x is equal to 3, we have minimum. So, this is a minimum point, minimum point. And what about x is equal to minus 2? It is a maximum point. But what we required? Maximum value and minimum value. So, we have to find out f of 3. f of 3 is 2 times of 3 cube minus 3 times of 3 square minus 36 times of 3 plus 2. If you are simplified, then you will have minus 79. So, f of 3 gives minus 79. This is the minimum value. Okay, friends. Now, we have to find out f of minus 2. So, at x is equal to minus 2 if you are sub substituted, then f of x is 2 times of minus 2 whole cube minus 3 times of minus 2 whole square minus 36 times of minus 2 plus 2. If you are simplified, then you will have minus 66. So, this minus 66 is the maximum value. Okay, friends. Is it clear for everyone? Friends, now I am giving a task for you. So, you do this problem and verify with the answers. After getting the results, okay, please uh, give a feedback in the comment box. I will verify your data correct or wrong also. Okay. Now, given problem is find the maximum and minimum values of f of x is equal to 3x to the power of 4 minus 2x cube minus 6x square plus 6x plus 1. Okay, friends. You remember uh, this is a single valued function. So, you have to go through the above method and also this is the degrees 4 you have so you will get this three stationary values verify you have to get these are the stationary values that is 1 minus 1 1 by 2 these three are the stationary values at x is equal to minus 1 you will get a minus 6 at x is equal to 1 you will get the value 2 at x is equal to 1 by 2, you will get the value 2.4375. Already I told you the stationary values. So, where it is a maximum and a minimum and verify with this answer. Remember friends, minimum means if you are getting a two values minimum at a, suppose minimum you are getting at 1 comma 1 by 2. At 1 you have 2, here you have a 2.4. Which is minimum value, least value is what? 2 only least value. So, you can say at x is equal to 1, we have a minimum. Not uh, 2 point, uh, these two, you won't get a uh, minimum values or 2. Minimum value you will get only 1 value. Suppose if you are getting a 2 values, in that you have to take a least value. Okay? Right. Thank you for watching this video.